Prosthetics have become an even more problematic issue in Armenia since the recent war. Amputees here face the dilemma of having to choose between either cheap, low-quality prosthetics, restricting mobility and quality of life, or very expensive prosthetics, which the vast majority of people cannot afford. Since prosthetics are usually being replaced about every three years, they represent a recurring problem. OCNI is a non-profit research and development platform focused on creating next-generation innovative prosthetics for amputees in Armenia and across the world. Our NGO was founded to achieve two things. Firstly, helping the victims of the recent war in sustainable matter. And secondly, creating innovation locally in Armenia for a global impact. My name is Heik Bakudians. Uh, I'm originally from Germany and the UK. And I'm currently the CEO of OCNI. For the prosthetics part, we are looking at two different kinds of prosthetics. One are the bionic prosthetics, which are going to be AI driven and are going to remind you more of a robotic, uh, futuristic prosthetic. Whereas the second is going to focus on mechanical parts. Here, it is going to be about creating low cost, yet high quality and very sturdy prosthetics. To achieve our ambitious goals, we are partnering with renowned institutions and universities in both Armenia and abroad. Together with Fab Lab, we helped the international humanitarian organization Doctors Without Borders to create 3D printed face prosthetics for burn victims earlier this year. One of our strongest partners is Tumor Labs. Our engineers are led by renowned professionals and scientists, including from Stanford University, Google and the medical industry. It had a very great impact on this generation and the war. Uh, many lost their best friends or um, brothers and sisters, so it, they, they really felt connected with Okni. Our engineers are right now partnering with local fashion designers to create empowering prosthetic covers. Such cosmetic covers are completely missing in Armenia despite a strong need and demand. These covers will contribute to the amputee's comfort and mental well-being by turning prosthetics into an empowering fashion statement and fighting the stigma around prosthetics. I'm Haikui. Okni for me is a holistic approach to human beings. It's allowing them access to mental health. What I'm trying to achieve at Okni is Armenian legacy, unity in who we are, especially after the war. We realize how strong we are when we get together and do amazing things. Today, we're raising funds for our phase one, which includes producing prosthetic covers, creating an initial mechanical prosthetic prototype, and kicking off our research for bionic prosthetics. With the funds, we will purchase 3D printers and machinery, pay our engineers and much more. For more information on what your donations will be spent on, as well as our commitments to transparency and accountability, please visit our website. Your donation today could be a real game changer in sustainably improving the lives of disabled people and war victims in Armenia and beyond through innovation. Okni is exactly that. It's getting together with people all over the country and the world, finding solutions to specific problems that we face, and then sharing our solutions with the world.